So what you're about to see is a rear end collision between our cyclist dummy and a truck. So the dummy will be launched down the track and at the end momentum will carry the dummy and cyclist forward where the truck will come up behind it and collide with it. And then hopefully it'll be at three speeds with the last one being 80 kilometers an hour uh, if the dummy lasts that long. <laughs> well, we're expecting to kind of see how well our system works like that we can actually get a successful test, the dummy stays upright, and we can collect some good quality data from the sensors that are in the head, as well as map it in 3D using the markers on the dummy and then the GoPros we have set up near the collision zone. So the application is to uh, eventually develop a tool that the collisions investigation unit can use to kind of help them reconstruct and understand what happens during fatal collisions between cyclists and cars. Uh, if a person ended this far from their bike and their bike ended up in this shape, they can use our kind of project to say, okay, the bike and the person would have had to have been hit roughly from this angle going this speed. Everyone's worked really hard on this project and so I think we're all pretty thrilled to actually see our project uh, successful and get put to good use.